And what's up guys? Welcome to another episode of Don't get out, don't get out, don't get out, don't get out. <laughs> 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 If I say it's not spicy. Ah yeah, I really oh, no. It is time to visit the Reno King. Wow. So um Today we have a secret guest. Alright, good morning guys. So today we'll be filming the second episode of our new series Against the Norm. And today's episode, we're gonna be trying out a new profession, content creation. Uh, it's pretty weird because this is sort of like the same profession as me. But today we're gonna be meeting a veteran in Singapore. You guys already know Henry Tia. <laughs> you guys know who it is. Name is Mr. Icon Chia. Okay, so last night when I asked Kate for the production timing, what's the call time, what's the schedule for today, she actually told me, sorry, we can't send you anything because we're gonna surprise you. So most likely, both of them, they're gonna try to prank me and Mink. You know, pranks, content. So Mink and I, we have decided to Uno reverse them. We're gonna prank them first. We're actually like five minutes late, but we're gonna prank call them and say, oh my gosh, we just woke up. <coughs> eh, hey, you're there already, ah, Kate. Uh, 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 uh. Shit, we overslept, yeah. Me and Ming just woke up. Oh, okay, okay. You tell me your ETA then? Probably need like one hour, eh. Okay, uh. Okay, uh, can, can. You, you just you just try and get here ASAP then. Okay, <laughs> just kidding, it's a prank. <laughs> hey! I hate you, ah! Uh. Hey, why, why ENFP is so chill, one? I was expecting her to be like, hey, how are we all here already? <laughs> She's just dwelling in chaos. Yes, yeah. Really ENFP dwelling in chaos. Oh, yo. Wow, oh, this ENFP reaction really okay, not good. <laughs> Hello. Daniel, I'm a fan here. Eh. Hey, thank you so much. Yeah, fans as well. I'm a subscriber. Hey, oh. And I'm like, how did this guy shoot and release so many videos? We also don't know, uh, me. We also don't know. I really, my heart. I know, I know. Stop, you know. No, she outside very calm, but inside she like, eh, hey, how are you? Yeah, cause in front, in front, I'm like, uh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, then I just say, what a diva, yeah, one hour late. Yeah, look. First time we meet and he's one hour yeah. late. Yes. What epic zero. <laughs> yes, we got that. I mean, Hey, is he the one that lost all the weight? Yeah, me. Holy shit, good job, man. <laughs> but I thought I, I also lost weight. No, I'm trying so hard. <laughs> you are like my face bow now. Ikan or Ikan? Ikan, Ikan, Ikan. Ikan, Ikan. Five minutes into the interview. <laughs> Don't, What's your name, ma? I always say Ikan. I always say Everything in this dream is a mashup of like the whole behind the scenes process, the before and the after. Product, 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 cinematic, boom, man, sexy, shining. And the photo, as, as I. Right, this is Reno King in real life. <laughs> <laughs> this is a UFO fan, there's no blades. Hey, do you know it's designed by a uh, local professor, like NTU professor? <laughs> Engineering professor? Engineering. Yeah, I think it's your heritage. Yeah, it is. <laughs> Right, we are taking a commercial break. Is he your first time meeting Aiken? No. No, you met him before? Mm. But it's pretty cool, eh? Yeah. My first time meeting him. Oh, is it? No, to be honest, oh right, we have shot a lot of people, right? Mm. Who are very professional on set. Then it's like, the after, right? Yeah. It's a wrap! Yeah. 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 What's, what industry are we in? Media. media. Yeah. Put on the media act, you know? Yeah. I mean, if anyone is wondering, I wouldn't say it's like he's faces or anything. Yeah, it's just, it's just it's him. A, no lah, it's, it's a, a, it's a, working, it's a, a job, working It's a working face. It's a job hazard. <laughs> okay, but Aiken's really cool. Mm, That's a, he's stay tuned for the episode. It'll be coming out on the 1st of April. It's under a new channel that we're creating called The Next Level. Basically next helping level. you go to the next level. Oh, nice. Hey, yeah. So uh, we'll have a few series coming out, but mm. this is the first one. And it's helping you explore careers. If you might be interested in, but a bit scared, don't know what's going on, like more new age careers, mm. then stay tuned. It was a yoga move. Is it? Yeah. <laughs> Like Have you all le learned like the Tai Chi thing last time? Okay, while well, the ENFPs yeah. carry on their thing, Kate is my co-host. She's also the producer of the show. And yeah, we get to meet a lot of these interesting spoil. people spoil. like spoil. Aiken. Spoil. Yeah, ENFPs. ENFP. Spoil. 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 <laughs> okay, la, we go playground. La. Let's go. La. <laughs> <laughs> ENFP style. <laughs> okay, some of you guys have been asking what is ENFP. It's basically the MBTI personality type. I surround myself with most ENFPs because they are super fun, but they are also. <laughs> they are also. <laughs> they are also. Brain cell number one, brain cell number two. Yep, ENFP in a nutshell. <laughs> it is time to visit the Renault King bathroom. Wow! Damn! This is like the condo, the sauna. Wow! The shower head, Oh my god! Can you give us a tour? 
Yeah, okay. <laughs> so, um, this is the only place in the house where we wanted a bit more like woody texture. La. It's right. not real yeah. wood, obviously, but like um, it's laminates, I think. Yeah. So, the rest of the house is very black, grayscale kind of yeah. thing. This room is room, and this toilet has the best lighting. So, where you're standing is the best spot oh. because the light will hit the. Do you take your old TV? I do, I do take some <laughs> selfies here. <yeah. laughs> and then there's a heater. Oh, the heater, right? Very, very weird. You can um, preset it on your phone. Technology. Yeah. I'm like, what? Who? All of these brands, please sponsor me. <laughs> <laughs> I need a toilet. And have you seen this? This is one of my mom's favorite device, but it's actually a styrene, and you can basically oh. dry your clothes. So you just have to like hang it out, and then it's like you got lights, uh, and then you oh. also got like a, a dryer. Yeah. So there's oh. a fan that dries your clothes. It's you. <laughs> oh, yeah, quite cool. So if you don't want to like throw your body out the window and hang the bamboo, I mean this is a worthwhile investment idea. Yeah, crazy. Yeah. Well, I love it. Quite cool, quite cool. I like the That's matte so black nice. aesthetic. Yeah, sorry, mom. It's like bachelor. Style. And then now she has to stay. Yeah, then she. <laughs> yeah, so this like if we have food, then this will. <laughs> okay, now it's a full house tour already. Yeah. From, from the toilet. <laughs> oh, can I show you this? One? Oh, this okay, let's do it. This is my favorite. So this is like the van, but when you turn it on. <gasps> Wow. This is like Tony Stark's house, yeah. Yeah. I don't know who really ever needs this, but we do make use of it. Oh, then if you come oh. this side. Why am I so excited? About yeah, why are you so excited? Yeah, <laughs> this one's quite cool. This one's quite cool, Wait, yeah. guys, can you guide me here? I'm quite lost. Wait, what, sorry, what, what is this? <laughs> yeah, what is this? So uh? We all like, what the heck? <laughs> <laughs> it moves. But we don't know what. When you cook, then it goes. Oh, okay. This is the vent. Yeah. The vent. Yeah. Yeah. This is the thing that caught my eye. Okay, wait. I turn on the lights. Sorry. So the lights are quite cool. They're dimmable okay. here also. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Then you switch on. Switch on. I feel like we're giving another uh, house tour. Uh. Yeah, so job hazard. Is he? He didn't even. This is from Lining, guys. <laughs> Lining, check okay. him out. Hey, sponsor me, my new office, please. Hey, Thank Lining you, it, guys. Sponsor him. Sponsor, <laughs> sponsor him. me. Sponsor my new if studio. You have extra give me also. A tough luck. A tough luck. <laughs> Do you have any advice? Let's say people who want to like join the content creation space. Basically me lah. Because I just graduated. And I'm like going full time into content creation. Mm. Any advice? My first advice when I knew that I'm working with you right. I actually told the crew. I was like, it tells you to slow down. <laughs> because I know like he's doing releases so often. And I know that that's a pressure that we give to ourselves. Mm -hmm. We want to set the standard. And then we feel like we have to maintain mm -hmm. that standard. Oh my gosh, I could have said it better. Right. So that I'm here to tell yeah. you that you can relax on the day that you really do have a video it's okay mm -hmm. yeah and like that you should pace yourself okay so this line from Aiken was really a huge slap in the face for me if you guys are new here welcome to the vlogu just for some context I started doing a daily vlog last year in November today is 11 November 2021 I just turned 25 and I've got a huge announcement to make from today onwards I'm going to be starting a daily vlog that's right I'm going to try to upload one vlogu every single day from now onwards at least until I go crazy or I burn out or I nobody was forcing me to do a daily vlog it was kind of just like my ego trying to tell myself that I can really upload one video every single day and it's kind of worked in a sense I've already done this daily vlog for like one to two months and I've already done it twice but at what cost? Forcing myself to upload one vlogu every single day really drained my creative juices and some days I'm so mentally drained that I can't even think I just sit down there and I just don't want to do anything after Aiken told me that line straight in my face I guess it gave me enough confidence to convince myself to put an end to the daily vlog just kill my ego and yeah moving forward I'm opting for a more sustainable option. I'm going to be posting 3 vlogs every week on Monday, Thursdays and Saturdays. And honestly speaking, 3 vlogs a week is still a lot but I definitely can manage it better than doing a daily vlog. Big shout out to Aiken for the advice. Back to the vlog. -o. The truth is right, and I hate to break it to everyone out there, no one is that important mm. and no one really like, you okay. know, if you take a break that is good for you for one yeah. day, you create mm -hmm. better content mm -hmm. in the end. Mm -hmm. So, mm -hmm. yo. But I really like watching it. I like watching it. Thank you. Time. Another thing he does that I don't even do is edit. So he is very particular about his own edit and the storytelling that goes behind it, which is super. But it's also one more other thing to do yeah. uh, that we don't see, so. Thank you. Hustle. Are you starting any venture or like maybe this year? Anything? You are my inspiration, so maybe hey, this year no I start talking or so. Yeah, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Maybe we can collab. I, maybe yes, you can gonna create. Maybe this Soon. year. Maybe this year. Maybe today. <laughs> Nice to meet you, nice Felix. Nice to meet you, man. All right, what's up, guys? We're here with Mr. Felix. Man, we're lost. We just attended the Hugo workshop.
uh, he's an exchange student, NUS exchange student from where? From Canada. So Felix, you do tricking, right? I do. Would you like to see something? Yes. Just for some context, right? We are at the basement of Ion Orchard right now. I'm not sure. Sh- where is this? Yeah, I'm not sure why everything is closed up, right? But this looks like a perfect set for some. Boom. He's out. Okay, he's out. Whoa, whoa. He's not out. Never out. 